What's up, guys? You already know. It's me, Kira, and we're at Mayhem, the biggest local tournament of all time. Probably 300 plus entrants in the biggest and best region of all time. So if you guys want any inside looks as to what people are feeling, how, how players feel, what they do to prepare, uh, what it's like in an actual tournament, then this is where you find out. How many hours of sleep did you get, and what did you eat for breakfast? Okay, I had six hours of sleep, which I think is good because that's like, it goes along with your circadian rhythm or whatever. Wait, it goes along with your circadian rhythm? Don't you, don't you need full eight hours? No, it's six hours. It's, every, it's one and a half hour increments. Okay, okay, okay. So that's like, if I do one and a half hour increments, I'm like maxed out energy. Because then I don't wake up in the middle of my REM sleep, right? And for breakfast, I had chicken breast and green beans. And uh, does, so you feel you're pretty prepared? Yeah, I mean, I've been eating pretty healthy this whole week. I feel pretty good. Nice, dude, nice. All right, dude. Uh, I also see that you're TOing, so I'll let you, I'll let you get back to that. Right. But thank you. Thanks. Uh, what did you do to prepare for this tournament? Uh, I drank a lot. <laughs> and how do you feel you're going to do? Great. I'm going to do great. What's uh, your overall feeling of, uh, what's the vibe you're getting from the tournament today? I know there's a lot of Mayhems. Uh, they all have different vibes. Well, what do you feel today, dude? Uh, it feels like everyone is trying to prepare for Evo. Like, so everyone's here. They're like, let me, let me go to Mayhem, and if I do well, I'm automatically going to do well at Evo. Guaranteed. Nice. What, uh, so... <laughs> So you think this is a big precursor to how people are going to feel? Huge precursor. Like, if you do well here, you're going to be mentally, like, in the game. You're going to be like, oh, I'm playing good. I can play well at EVO next week, you know. Yeah, it's just a precursor. Sick, dude. Thanks. And uh, to any random noob that's watching, what do you want to say to them? Anything you want? Dude? Uh, read the inner game of tennis. <laughs> there you go, dude. Read it. Dude, every top player just says you're supposed to think you're going to win everything. Is that, is that always what happens? Oh, yeah, absolutely. If you go in with confidence, especially like I do in teams, then we're good to go. Really? Not even if, uh, what, what if it's like you're setting yourself up for failure? Like you're going to be like, oh, man, I didn't set out to do what I wanted to do. It doesn't matter. No, it doesn't matter. Because the only teams I'm actually, like the two teams I'm scared of are like Armada team or Pufat. That, those are the only teams I'm, I'm worried that I wouldn't be able to beat. But everyone else, I'm really confident that I can. Damn, dude, this guy's pretty good. Do you, do you think uh, taking breaks and playing other games throughout the week instead of Melee, do you think that helps you at all? or? Um, I, th I think playing like Street Fighter would be the most, like the biggest one because it helps you play a neutral game. But um, other than that, if you play MOBA, it's really hard to like, you know, put that to, to, to Smash. So I still practice Smash every day. How much does tech skill practice against a computer help? Oh, a lot. You feel really comfortable doing it because you're doing repetition. Um, so I, right now I practice like two hours of tech skill a day uh, in preparation for Evo. So it's been helping a bunch, actually. Yeah. Nice. Uh... Any, any last words for the, the millions of, of no names out here? The millions, uh, you already know. <laughs> That's about it. All right, dude, obviously you guys already know this is lucky. Um, all right, I have a question. Do you, do you care about seeds? Do you care who you play or do you just, do you just go in expecting to beat everybody? No, I don't, I don't even look at my bracket, man. I just play. When they call me to play, I play. It doesn't matter who it is. Nice. And uh, do, you, do you do anything specific to warm up before a tournament or anything like that? I chew gum. Mm -hmm. what, what, what brand? What brand? Orbit. It's Orbit. Yeah. Orbit gum, dude. Orbit gum, guys. Uh, how, how prepared do you feel for today, for this tournament? Uh, not very prepared. I've been like spending all my free time becoming the world's best PM player. So I don't know how prepared I'll be for Melee today, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try my best. <laughs> how, much, how much does PM help Melee, and how much does Melee help PM? Um, I think PM's been helping a lot with my neutral, because in that game, I, I still play like Fox, Falcon, Wolf. and. Um, it's kind of the same concept as in Melee, except in that game it's a lot easier to get combo to death off a of grab. So my neutral is essentially getting better since I, if I get grabbed once in PM, I die. So it's making me a lot more afraid to like hit people's shields in this game, and it's, it's helping me stay a lot more safer in general, I want to say. Alright, last question. To the person you're going to play first, like the very first person you play in singles today, any words of advice to them, the future scrub that you're about to body? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, my, my B. <laughs> Do you, do you care about looking at the bracket ahead of time before you play your, your opponent? Yes. So that I can just prepare beforehand. No, because I overthink it. Uh, and that's, that's not good. So. What is your goal for this tournament? To win. To win the whole thing? Yeah. So no matter what, you think you should always just go shoot, shoot to win or what? Yeah. What if, what if you're a complete scrub? Then 
get better and just, just I don't know. All right, cool. Um, I'm a tournament not want to win. Like, are you just going to play for fun? Then why even come here? Damn, dude. Real talk. What'd you have for breakfast? A ham and cheese and egg croissant and milk. And is that is that pretty good for a uh, for a breakfast? Yeah, not bad. Is there anyone you really want to play today? Uh, I'll, I want to you up. That's it, guys. You heard it. It's not going to happen, though. It's not going to happen.